so yeah i think we'll get started so hi everyone this is uh, sharan and we are here for the for the third session today and it is on butterflies of bangladesh by mr amit kumar niyogi he has completed his master of science on entomology and he is working on butterflies since uh, 2013 and he has published many national and international articles on butterflies of bangladesh and he is currently a uh, working brac it was previously called as uh, bangladesh rural address advancement committee as an entomologist and uh, i guess amit you can you can start your presentations thank you saran hello everyone uh, uh, this is amit kumar niyogi from uh, bangladesh welcome to all uh, to my presentation actually uh, i think hope uh, all are well in the global pandemic uh, situation and all are well so uh, however it is uh, it's a great opportunity to share my uh, experience and my country situation about butterflies it's a, it's a pleasure to me thank you saran and and the road uh, groups invite me in this presentation. However, uh, I, am, I am now going to my presentation. Uh, I am um, actually uh, all knows where is Bangladesh, but uh, for many many people who are um, uh, from outside the Indian region, don't know where it's possible to don't know where is Bangladesh. It's Bangladesh is situated in the South Asia, uh, and uh, it's it's bounded by the uh, three side from uh, India and the southern uh, east part. Sorry for the introduction. And uh, whatever it is, uh, I was in the uh, presentation slide on our forest area. And you can see from the map, Bangladesh has very fragment forest area. Uh, most of the uh, forest is um, situated in the southeast position in, in the map. And some are the southwestern position that means that this is the Sundarbans. This is covered by mangrove forest, and some of the fragment uh, forest are here in the northeast position, in the bordering side of uh, Asham. Those uh, are quietly same habitat like as Asham. And the second map, you can see the some habitat type of uh, uh, forest here. You can see the mangrove forest here, some tropical mixed evergreen forest here, some deciduous forest here, and some human settled forest here. And uh, in the uh, northeast uh, region, some forests are already uh, um, um, planted by the uh, Bangladesh Forest Department, and also some natural forests exist here. Now I'm going to the uh, donation of uh, Bangladesh. Actually, this is the eco ecological uh, partition of the Bangladesh. Here you can see the coastal zones and the uh, uh, Barendro zones, wh which is a drought area. And uh, this is the our zones, and this is the uh, uh, southern zone, and these are the hilly areas. Uh, actually, these southeastern part and northeastern part are uh, covered most of the uh, percentage of forest is in uh, of Bangladesh. And the second map uh, for uh, uh, distribution of butterflies, we have divided in seven zones or regions, what you can say, uh, in Bangladesh uh, map. Uh, this is called the uh, northeastern part, this is called the uh, uh, southeastern part, 
and this is called the uh, northwestern part and this is the south central part uh, and this is the center this is for our 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 uh, measuring the butterflies diversity in bangladesh we we develop the um, or regional dividation and uh, i want to share some the experience from the past actually who were the uh, who uh, or who was uh, started uh, butterflies work in bangladesh and uh, here you can see two, uh, two, uh, two person, both, both of the uh, professor of Department of Jew, and they are working and they are work in geology from since uh, 1960. Now they are both a retired person and they stabilized the most significant part or research in butterflies in Bangladesh. They, they stabilized their uh, museum on butterflies. They, they established uh, two uh, open butterfly park, Bangladesh. One is uh, in central region and one is uh, the southern region. How the poets come uh, come to the point uh, on the butterflies, number of butterflies in Bangladesh. All knows uh, he's uh, the English guy, Torben B. Larson, who have made uh, the first butterfly checklist in Bangladesh in 2004. That was his own personal work. After that, the IUCN uh, brought the, his work and published it in, in their banner. <clears throat> Bangladesh, if we want to say how many butterflies are recorded or how many butterflies are uh, um, confirmed from Bangladesh, it, it's very difficult to say because uh, in the checklist of Torban, he mentioned a total 311 uh, number of species which have been uh, recorded or confirmed by the other other literature literature. Additionally, he mentioned some species starting to occur as per the habitat habitat uh, habitat and geographical locations. And he gave additional six uh, sixty two hundred species uh, as per his experience could be here uh, or could be. Uh, starting to occur. And likely the total fauna stand 500, 550. Now, after that, uh, after the urban checklist since uh, 2004, 2010, no more work on butterflies diversity in Bangladesh, excluding some MSC thesis part of uh, the butterfly research has been conducted. So there was a big gap between 2004 and 2010. After 2010, in 2011, Dr. Monarson Twin and Dr. Sophie Khaida uh, has jointly published a book within 225 species of butterflies. That confirms we have 25 species, confirmed species. Then, a Facebook group formed with some butterfly enthusiasts named as uh, Butterfly Bangladesh. And gradually, the people are starting to fall in love in the in the scaly jewels. And it was it was uh, established in 2013, uh, last month of the 2012. That is the major starting of butterfly research and butterfly knowledge sharing in Bangladesh. Uh, and we can proudly say since 2013, till the members of this group added 50 plus new rec country records 
as a new distributional records for Bangladesh and contribution a lot in Bangladesh to enrich the butterfly checklist. And many confirmation records had been enlisted, which as mentioned in tournament state checklist as certain to occur. After the incorporated all valid confirmed records and new distributional records, now we can say we have 403-403 number of species has been recorded so far. But uh, is there some uh, confusion? Because many people are uh, photographer and uh, uh, nature uh, enthusiasts, so they don't publish the papers or scientific documentation on uh, new records. And that's why we can't say or some uh, uh, data are missing here, the actual number. Now, I want to focus on the butterfly diversity, considering the world diversity and uh, its habitat variation and geographical con um, condition, the northeastern of man's uh, sealet and the southeastern part means Chitong, which is uh, covered by five districts, means Chitong, Cox Bajar, and Ch three Chitong Hills district, means Bandarwan, Rangamati, and Thagachuri which is bounded by the Indian, some of part of Indian borders and some of part by the Myanmar borders and very hard to reach area is there. Additionally, some rare species also uh, found in these areas because of their uh, hard to reach uh, pockets because people uh, of general people are not allowed to go the Harturuch area because of their security, personal security. And uh, this is very dense forest area. So we have very rare species as context as our country records are exist there. Now um, I can conclude uh, uh, family-wise diversity. Um, we have a uh, fixed number of families uh, uh, families in, in Bangladesh. First of all, uh, Papillonidae, which contain uh, 34 species. Then uh, Pyridae, which uh, contain 32 species. Nymphilidae, which contains uh, 20, uh, 123 species. The Nymphilidae and Lycanidae like same. The diversity of Nymphilidae and Lycanidae is more than the uh, rest of families. And Rodentidae, it only consists of four species, and the Hesperity more confusing species. This is uh, the number of recorded species is uh, 89, but it could be more because of we can't uh, identify the species on the basis of photography. So we need to cut them and then need to taxonomy. That's why some species are missing or we overlook as a common species. So that's why the number of, uh, uh, number of Hesperidae uh, is uh, less than the natural level. Now I can want to share some uh, pictures from the family-wise pictures and uh, some rare butterflies, which is found in the hard to reach areas. Uh, here we can see the some a mud puddling group or colony or of, of some papillary families. And uh, actually this kind of colony is usually find, uh, found in uh, Northeast and Southeast region. But rest of the region is, is not possible to found this kind of colony. In central region, some deciduous forest exists. So, so here you can find some lichenity colony, but it's it's very rare to see a big colony with the swallowtail butterfly in 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 this in northeast 
northwest or southern portion of the uh, country. So this is this is for the northwestern and, and northeastern and southeastern uh, portion. And um, here you can see some uh, uh, big butterflies, common club tail, which is recently recorded from the groups. One of our our um, enthusiast has been recorded uh, since 2017 as a new country record in common club tail. Spot sword tail is quite uh, rare here because <coughs> uh, uh, most of the swamp uh, in the forest are very much wet as as they prefer. So the colony found uh, the uh, colonies found is very difficult during the monsoon season. You can see the colony in the most of the them uh, in the dry season means November to February, and some of the uh, post monsoon season. Now you can see some. Uh, Butterflies, common butterflies in uh, Pyridae. Uh, common grass yellow. This is common in um, in all over the country. And spot tail grass yellow. This is recently recorded um, uh, since uh, 2008 by one of our our moderator uh, as central level. After that, it, it recorded from the several several location. The spot puffing. This is <laughs> very unique. This is uh, just cited one time in a in a very public place or public university that's called uh, Janginagar University that is, that is situated in the Janginagar uh, uh, that is in the Dhaka city and this is spotted by one of our admin and the bath white this is quite rare we have just one sighting from the Ponchogor which is the uh, uh, um, northwest uh, western part of the Bangladesh, uh, just bordering area of uh, West Bengal. We just one sighting from there. And you can see some uh, jejabils. Those are common, but but the red breast jejabil is quite rare here. Uh, and yolo also yolo also found in the high altitude. Uh, altitude and the dead based jejabel is uh, found in in Samoa um, uh, in northeast and southeast. Now we we'll focus on our nephility, which which contains a, a, a big number of species. We have uh, we have. Uh, 12 species of crows, and you can see some crows and uh, a group of colonies here. And the magpie crows uh, is recorded in 2015, one by one of our moderator, and he is also a, uh, a butterfly enthusiast uh, and conducting his research on butterflies since 14. Here you can see one of the most uh, rarest butterfly in Bangladesh, which is found in the Sundarban area, means Sundarban mangrove forest, and that is called as uh, the Sundarban crow. It is quite quite different subdistal area. You can see the picture. Uh, this is and um, this is. Quickly, fairly found in uh, Shukdurban areas in some uh, selected location, not not uh, at all. And uh, this is the bat white. Uh, sorry, uh, this is the um, white tiger, which also found in the uh, Shukdurban region and uh, and some of the adjacent areas. Now I, I want to introduce some of the Lycanidae butterflies of our countries. 
So very recently we, we found from the Northwestern uh, region, uh, that's from the Rajshay Jela, which is bordering area of uh, India. And uh, we found a common Uva blue for the first time, <coughs> which has uh, certain to, as mentioned as a certain to occur in Bangladesh. And we got it a Goba garden. <coughs> in the underside, the, this is monkey puzzle. This is a very common <coughs> butterfly in urban areas, especially in Dhaka city. The, uh, that can lay their eggs, the Ixora species. And uh, you can found them in the, in the Ixora species. This is a, a colony which are captured from the Northeast region during the post monsoon uh, post season. Uh, and if you if you visit uh, the our Northeast region or Southeast region during the uh, pre monsoon and post monsoon, you can you can see the differ differ of uh, variation uh, differ and uh, variation of the species and and their abundance. We got uh, recently. We got uh, a very rare species as context of our 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 country. This is plain, and uh, this is found in the bordering area of northeast region, uh, which is uh, bordered by the Assam region. And uh, also, we found the rosy oak blue, means Arovala elata. We have a very diverse oak blue group. We have 90 plus, means 20, 20 species of oak blue. And most of them are occurred in the Northeast and Southeast area. Now my focus on uh, the lichenity. Uh, you can see the smallest lichenity or blue uh, found ever in Bangladesh. And this is found in a very peri urban area, which is just beside the Dhaka city. And uh, the abundance is good. Recently, one of our colleagues has been recorded, uh, Arofala Rama, which has uh, misidentified uh, in 2017 as Arofala Ania. Then uh, after uh, two years, he published a article on this, this thesis and uh, in this uh, country records. Now my focus uh, in the Hesperity, the most confusing group ever in found in Bangladesh, also in uh, the world. Uh, you can see the vein discard hooper, which is, which is the smallest SPD found ever in Bangladesh, and the uh, Indian Bob, and uh, Indian Owl King, and Plain Palm Garden. I have, I have uh, displayed some of the representative and uh, 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 rarest butterfly ever found Uh, this is the small green owlet, which is frequently found in uh, during the evening or uh, uh, very early morning in the northeast and southeast region, but not at all. But it, it's some selected regions. And this is the lighter straws that is frequently found in northeast region, and. Uh, very closely as Asham border. Now I am showing you some rarest species found from 2013 to 2000, uh, till now. Uh, one of our our uh, enthusiast who is no more, uh, Mr. Uh, uh, Mr. Munir Hamid Khan. He has recorded several number of rare species and and 
and shared with this species with the I found butterflies and many of Indian authors as several groups. And that was the first ever record in, in the Asham region. Uh, in, that was in the in the Asham region also. And uh, near is the Asham region also. And that is uh, the Falvas downfly, which has been recorded by the uh, late Muhammad Khan in 2013. After this found, he shared these pictures with many renowned uh, authors of uh, Indian butterfly. And uh, if you go to the, our northeast uh, part in hard to reach pockets, you will get this rarest butterfly that is called Texas Harlequinus. Uh, we commonly called as Harlequin. This is species is occurred a quite number of uh, good event. And uh, some rare butterflies, which has been recently recorded in, uh, in, in Bangladesh checklist as here. This is a shiny velvet bob and the blue admiral. We all know the admiral and what admiral is the high and butterfly. And, uh, very frequently found in Himalayas, uh, even if you know, yeah, Himalayas. And uh, we found in uh, Blue Admiral in 2018, only two individuals in the same place. <laughs> Here is some uh, more rarest uh, butterflies, that is a uh, constable. Constable is quite uh, uh, abundant in uh, India, some region, especially in Gupta Tiger Reserve or, or Western Guard. And, but in Bangladesh, very few sightings have occurred, few years. And uh, here is uh, the banded martulis, only three sighting has recorded uh, on these butterflies from the one sighting from the northeast part and two sighting from the south part. And uh, this is, this is uh, the recently recorded species, lipid blues, and uh, we, re we recorded it in 17 in Natural History Museum, Journal of Natural uh, and this species cited just one time uh, last few years. Recently, uh, this is uh, the cars. Uh, recently, this is uh, recorded by one of our enthusiasts. He is professionally a doctor and a uh, bird watcher. He recorded this species in the very remote areas of Bandurban that is uh, situated in the Chitam Hill Tracks districts and uh, bordering area of Myanmar. Uh, there is some more recently recorded butterflies uh, that is Spanglet and uh, uh, which is recorded uh, by the late Tania Khan, wife of uh, uh, late Munir Ahmed Khan. Husband wife was a very good butterfly enthusiast, and they have recorded several number of species for Bangladesh. Recently, one of our members from uh, 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 Butterfly Bangladesh, he has recorded a green striped plumber from the Rangamati, which is uh, the bordering area of. Uh, 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 Indian Mizoram state. Red Imperial, uh, this is found in the bordering area of uh, Asham, uh, also in the north. Area. And that is the Jungle Glory, recently found in, in the uh, Bandarban district, very, very high at issue. And uh, the place was very remote from the local place. Uh, 
this upazila called as thanchi which is the southernmost upazila of now i want to focus on on some uh, uh, urban butterflies which we have recorded during last few years actually most of the uh, most of the enthusiast or photographer are city based so they are they are uh, they are um, uh, basically they are found some um, there is butterfly in the butterfly uh, city we since 2013 to t we recorded 145 numbers of the species uh, which means uh, more than 40% species of total number total uh, number of recorded species in bangladesh in dhaka city so dhaka have some uh, gardens with with uh, manually planted and flowering planted some rare vagrant species are found uh, rarely there now i i want to share some conservation initiative uh, in bangladesh um, which have been done by the our facebook group or our young group who are involved mostly involved in the butterfly butterfly photography taxonomy we conducted different number of uh, butterfly meets and butterfly raids that is the uh, butterfly identification program within the butterfly uh, enthusiast and uh, we conducted the largest butterfly photography exhibition ever in bangladesh at central place it was in uh, the bangladesh national museum which is which is located in the central of the dhaka city many visitors visit uh, this place every day so we conducted uh, five days and uh, the we conducted the exhibition uh, uh, on five days and uh, whereas the total number of visitor was more than 13000 and in this occasion we we try to uh, invite and uh, incorporated all the stakeholder and the scholars around the country who are involved with the Uh, uh with the butterfly taxonomy wildlife nature nature photography and also the uh, our government especially the ministry of forest environment and climate change for conservation aspect and this uh, exhibition has been uh, dedicated by the late munir ahmed khan earlier i told his uh, background there is the some moment of our exhibition uh, you can see the gather people uh, and that was the munir ahmed khan now for conservation aspect uh, this this program is very unique for bangladesh every year we arrange a butterfly fair that is hosted by the department of zoology jahangir university and uh, this program is uh, is uh, organized uh, by the dr mona mona sin since 2010 there is some banner uh, of butterfly fair in 2013 and 2019 this is the uh, most special acknowledgement on butterfly research and uh, uh, conserving butterflies who are involved with the butterfly research and 
butterfly uh, conservation. Every year in Butterfly Fair, they announce a butterfly young enthusiast as a honor of his work. And uh, last, last that, that has been introduced in 2014 and four members of our group and uh, two already in our moderator are achieved this honorary award. And uh, maybe this is the last slide. Uh, I want to talk from um, our uh, conservation status. Last, since uh, 2015, IUCN, a, a international organization involved with the Bangladesh Forest Department and Bangladesh government, assessed a total of um, 315 uh, butterflies as per their guidelines and they publish it in, 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 in the public league. Uh, and uh, the assessment was done by the published article and uh, available data, the different institute and stakeholders. I think I have finished my presentation. Thanks to all. Thank you. Thank you so much, Amit. Uh, thank you so much for walking us mm -hmm. through the uh, butterflies of Bangladesh. And uh, a, a, lot, a lot of posts like, uh, you know, uh, Butterfly Festival and also the exhibition and photography uh, awards were all new to us. And uh, Amit, are you there? Yeah, I am here. Yeah, I could see a blank screen. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can hear you. So, so uh, thanks so much, Amit. Uh, thank you so much for this wonderful presentation. And people who have any questions for Amit uh, regarding Bangladesh butterflies, uh, please feel free to you know uh, send in your in the chat channel so that he'll be happy to answer. If you have any questions, or if you don't want to send in questions here. Please feel free to you know contact Amit in Facebook. He'll be happy to answer you all. And uh, Amit, uh, are there any uh, endemic butterflies to Bangladesh? Actually, uh, I already mentioned about the name of the Sundarban crow. This yeah. is uh, found in the Sundarban areas. Yeah. Some uh, expert says uh, that is the endemic in Sundarban regions. Okay. So I don't know. It is found in uh, the Indian portion. Of, uh, or not? Uh, have you any idea? Uh, this is found in Indian portion. I have no idea. I'm from South India, so <laughs> I, I, I clearly okay. don't have any idea about Sundarban crows. If not, uh, that will be the endemic species in Bangladesh. Otherwise, all are common, like as our Indian subcontinent species. Okay. So uh, someone from Sri Lanka, they're asking, what is the national butterfly of Bangladesh? One of our participant. Uh, that uh, this is not in, recorded in India. So th that will be the uh, endemic species. Okay. Yeah, uh, one more question uh, uh, is from Chaturi from Sri Lanka. She's asking, what is the national butterfly of Bangladesh? Actually, we have not any national butterflies, okay. but the postal, postal uh, departments uh, uh, announced some, uh, uh, some uh, tickets with yeah. a picture of butterflies. Okay. Uh, uh, any more questions? Commendable work. Keep up the work. I mean, it's for it's all for you. <laughs> uh, any more questions for Amit? Okay. Uh, I guess we.